What's going on guys? Great to be back in front of a camera like um, I so like I haven't posted on my YouTube for the past Two months I was gonna say three weeks, but then I realized it's actually two months Which is a very long time pretty much after the rebel competition. I sort of just stopped my like training intensity sort of went down and then I don't know I sort of wanted like a wee bit of a break and then I also moved house, got a new flat, which I'll show you in a sec. Um, and what else? Yeah, then I went home for Christmas. Um, I also went to Israel just before I went home for Christmas with Dan Cutting and Kitty from Hungary. Absolutely loving it. Look, I'm even on yeah, it. Yeah, you're on my snap, mate. But I, the plan for this video, my first video of 2017, because I've just moved to a new part of London and stuff, I need a new gym, and that means I need a new studio to train freestyling. So I'm going to go studio hunting and try and work out which is the best studio to train freestyling. So it may not be the most exciting video, but I'm just happy to get back in the vlogs like right it's coming up to quarter to one and i'm gonna get this done me and then we're, we're gonna check out the first potential studio so uh i've already like visited 10 of them but i've narrowed it down to like three or four which has studios i quite like the look of so um yeah i'm gonna have a training session in this studio probably gonna do like a commentary over the clips just so i can like talk you through what i thought of it and stuff but yeah Going to get this done me and then get on the bus. It's like a 10 minute bus, so it's pretty handy like, so see you there. Okay, so studio number one. Um, first impressions when I saw it, you know, I was pretty, I was happy enough with it. Uh, it's quite a good size. Um, you know, it's a wooden floor. It's quite good for lowers. It's not, it's not too slippy at all. Um, but yeah, one of the problems I'm going to have at pretty much every studio is, uh, is the height of the ceiling. Now in London, in, especially in central London, it is quite rare to find a studio with a really high ceiling. Um, so like that is just something that it is a wee bit annoying because a lot of my tricks, like my hardest tricks, are involve my neck and like winging the ball like twenty feet in the air and stuff. But the positive way to look at it is, it means I have to train different stuff. I have to sort of maybe focus more on my sits and stuff, which is what I want to do anyway. So like during the winter months when it's a bit cold and wet outside you know me having to work on other aspects to my freestyle is not the end of the world um and yeah like, i'm pretty happy with it but like one thing i will say in terms of the quality of the clips like my freestyle level has gone down quite a lot but that's just because december was a pretty didn't really train much um and yeah like this is only my second training session of the new year i hope in the next two weeks to pretty be uh, pretty much be back to my my full level like but but yeah in, in terms of the studio pretty happy with it uh probably give it like a 7.5 out of 10 uh so yeah like obviously the ceiling's annoying but it's the same in every studio but apart from that pretty decent and yeah this is a pretty mental clip by the way first time i've ever done three of these um so yeah Yo, welcome back to day two of Jimmy tries to find a decent studio in London to do football skills. Um, I promise you all my other vlogs are not going to be this dull, but finding a studio is quite important. So I'm going to pack my bags now and make my way to the gym.
right, welcome to the third and final day of finding Jamie's studio. Um, this one, this gym's actually the closest. It's only like a mile, it's like a mile walk, and it's a really nice walk. Yeah, so I'm not actually going to train in this studio. Uh, I've trained, trained freestyle the last five days. So I'm going to give it a wee break, like, but just going to use the gym, check it out, show you what it looks like, and yeah. Right, so we just got back to the gaff. Um, in relation to the last clip there, I was planning to like video the studio properly, but. There was a woman there like flinging this metal chain about and she literally nearly took my eye out. Yeah. 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 So I had to leave, pretty sharpish. But comparing all three studios, I think the best one is probably the second one. It's got like the best lighting it's um it's also the most like private and i also had the best session there like so i think for now i'm probably going to use that as my main main gym for training freestyle then i'll probably use the one from today as like the one i'll use for the gym doing weights and like legs bums and toms and shit like that i'm pretty pretty happy i've got a got a choice a choice of gyms Right guys, that's another great Jamie Knight vlog wrapped up. Um, tune in next week for more fresh content. Like, comment, subscribe. Like, comment, subscribe. Um, peace out.